Well, welcome to our classic car in this collection of classic and vintage Daimlers, and we begin with a 1964 Daimler SP250, or Daimler Dart, as it was unofficially known. That's followed by the first of several Daimler XJs. This is LTC895P. This is a 4.2 litre Series 2 XJ Coupe, or Daimler Sovereign Coupe. To pre war times now, and we've got a 1938 Daimler 15 Sport Saloon. Definitely one of the older Daimlers to feature in this particular collection. This is a 1919 Light 30 Phaeton with a 5 litre 6 cylinder engine. To slightly more recent times, and we've got a 1986 V12 powered Daimler Double Six. It was based on the Jaguar XJ. An RV5953, that was a Daimler Light 15 Mulliner Coupe. With the Daimler SP250 532JUB, this was registered in May of 1964. Two photos now of GTP421. This is a Daimler DB18 Sports Special. Drop a coupe. Fantastic car. This appears at some of the local events. Rear view of the same car, this time with the hood raised. And the Daimler V8 250 this time, based on the Jaguar Mark II, this car from 1966. The Daimler DS 420, this is a 1985 car, the based on the running gear of the old Mark 10 Jaguar. And the Lanchester, there are a few Lanchesters included here, this is a very smart little Mulliner two-door coupe, fixed head coupe. Another Daimler, this is a Series 2 Daimler Sovereign T registration, so that'll be what, about 1978 to 1979 that series ran for. And the British Motor Museum down at Gaydon, this is a 1955 Daimler Regency Mark II, predecessor to the Majestic. One of several period photos to appear here, this is a Mulliner bodied 20 horse limousine. All these old black and white photos can be seen on the old classic car site. Next up, here's a reminder that Daimler also produced military vehicles. This is 1958 Ferret Scout Car. GZ141, its registration actually is now on the 1998 BMW, so what this car is registered as now, I'm not quite sure. This is a 1935 Daimler 15 horse Sportsman. Got a rakish four light uh, sports saloon. And to the NEC Classic Car Show, we've got 2620UM. That's a March 1961 registered Daimler SP250 with a two and a half litre all alloy V8 engine under the bonnet. Next up, we've got a February 1938 sports saloon. This is the DB17 sports saloon. A rear three quarter view of a Daimler Sovereign Coupe TNP 591R that was registered in August of 1976 and has the 4.2 litre XK engine under its bonnet. To Alton Park, as you can clearly see, an LCV 522 that's a Daimler DB18 of the early 1950s. To the mid 1980s or December 1984 to be precise, we've got a 4.2 litre Daimler Sovereign here. Basically the Series 3 Jaguar XJ. Review of the same car now. Note the Vandenplatt badge on the rear uh, boot lid. So that was a top of the line model. This was at Donington several years ago. A SP250. A painted radiator surround, usually chrome. Another one here with the chrome front end, correct. 9982. DU from 1961. 
Little Lanchester, this is an LD10 from the early 1950s, a Briggs bodied car. There were two versions of the LD10 available, Briggs bodied and another by Barker, uh, which will feature later in this collection. A side view now of 931 DPE, this is a July 1957 registered car, I think this is a Daimler Conquest. A Series 2 Daimler Sovereign here, out to grass in a Welsh scrapyard about 15 years ago, it's no longer there. The magnificent 15 horse Daimler here, YS6252. There's their Martin Walters Wingham Cabriolet bodywork. This was at the Chumley Castle Classic Car Show. As was this magnificent machine, first of two photos of 950 DLW, which is 1956 3.5 litre Continental Coupe, body by Hooper. There's a rear view of the same car. What an amazing car that is. Also at Chumley Castle was RA3910. This is a 1927 20 stroke 17 Model Q Daimler. A lot more recent this KU registration, uh, circa August 1992, 4 litre XJ40. Daimler version of the old XJ40 Jaguar. A review of the same car at a different event. This was at Alton Park. Another white wall tyres. And spotted at the Ultima Park Gold Cup in 2021 was this e-registration Daimler Double Six V12 powered 5.3 litre car. Going back a few years, a handy information sheet on the front tells us this is the two and a half litre V8 from 1964. The wonderful V12 powered coupe here, the Daimler 66 coupe based on the XJC, so it's S registration, so that series ran from 1977 to 1978. And much, much older is this 1914 Daimler Londolette, 20 horsepower vehicle, absolutely magnificent. There's the engine of the same car. JJJ860D, this is a magnificent Daimler Majestic Major. The V symbols in the front vents on next to the headlights tell you that this is a V8 powered car, and there's a rear view of the same car. The Majestic had the 3.8 litre 6 under engine, and this had the 4.5 litre All Ali V8 by Edward Turner. Stonking car, that is. And the V8250, a bright red car from 1965 now. And another period photo from the old classic car image archive. This is a light 20 cabriolet. Close in three quarter shot now of another Daimler Dart. Looking quite purposeful on those very wide steel wheels. Another handsome pre-war Daimler saloon, this one, WH5645. That's a 1934 light 15. The six window, uh, six light coachwork. Oh dear, looking very sad in a Welsh scrapyard some years ago as the remains of this Daimler Conquest. Looking a lot happier is FPN 92. This is a 1951 Daimler DB18 consort, I believe. Three quarter view of a V8 250 EAN 621. The majority of these cars, the Daimlers, were automatic, but a few of these uh, Mark II based cars were manual gearboxed. Now, much earlier now, we've got a yellow and black machine here. This is 1946 Daimler DB18 Drophead Coupe. Very handsome machine indeed, as would this had they put it into production. This is P300 COR, this is 1996 Course Ticker Convertible based on a double six, the old X300 shape. Into the Haynes Motor Museum, we've got an Edwardian Daimler here from 1905. Another Lanchester. Of course, Lanchester was affiliated with Daimler at the time. ABU 574, that's a 1937 11 horsepower saloon. The 
Mark II based Daimler Tri 632 that was registered in April of 1969. Bit of a barn find now, a Lanchester LA-10, built up as a woody back in period. Again, early to mid-1930s in date. LXW-922, this appears to have been off the road for quite a few years now, but back then it was on the road at Chumley Castle. This was first registered in March of 1951, probably a DB-18, I believe. The front three-quarter view now of a Daimler Sovereign, based on the XJ Series 2. This is a P-Reg car and it's first registered in December of 1975. It's a 4.2 litre car. Bit of pedal action here. This particular pedal car features in the pedal car photo collection that I recently uploaded. And is of course based on a Daimler made by Lines Brothers. You don't often see a racing Daimler. But here's a Series 2 uh, Daimler Sovereign. This was at Alton Park many, many years ago. Is it still around? DJG424, that's a 1949 DB17 Cabriolet or Dropper Coupe Cabriolet, I think. 1964 Daimler SP250 now. Still plenty of classic and vintage Daimlers to come. First of two photos now of a Series 1 2.8 Daimler. K registration, so 1972 to 1973 in date. Sable is the colour. You can tell an early XJ by the reflectors that are built into the reversing lights on the boot lid there. This one's actually been fitted with the extra later reflectors beneath the back lights. Another Mark II based V8 250, this one from 1965 and spotted at the Alton Park Gold Cup in 2021 at the auction. The magnificent Daimler Van ALB892. This is based on the 1933 15 horsepower chassis. Another Daimler 15. This is an old photo of a 15 horse Rye Cabriolet. Uh, the full history of this car is also on the main old classic car site. I posted this photo up and it turns out it's still around. Now to Brooklands, and we spotted earlier this year a KV631. That's a 1935 12.6 Sports. Not quite sure what this one is, so if you can help me with this one, please. The registration is OCY42. Not quite sure the name of this particular Daimler. The rear body doesn't look all that familiar. Back to the British Motor Museum at Gaydon. This is a 1950 Daimler DE35 drophead coupe. A very, very eye catching car. The rear three quarter view of a Series 2 Vandenplas 66 T Reg car from 1978. Really original example, this was at an evening classic car meet earlier in 2021. Front view now of the same car. First I thought this was another Daimler Majestic Major with those Vs in the front grilles there, but I think this is actually the DR450, the limousine version of the Daimler Majestic Major. And another Lanchester LD10, Ham H45, and this has the Briggs body, um, the Barker body rather, the Briggs body car was shown earlier. And this is the Barker coach built version. And to the NEC Classic Car Show a few years back in the auction, we've got PNV 724F, another V8 250 saloon. And there's a period photo of a DR450 limousine based on the Majestic Major. This one from 1964. Thanks to Jim Walker for the photo. And back to Gaiden again and for 777JW, another V8 powered SP250. Fiberglass body, very unusual styling, not everyone's cup of tea perhaps. And then CXE 435, this is a 1936 Streamline Daimler. Very handsome machine, this was in the 2021 Capesthorn Classic Car Show. And over to Alton Park again a few years ago, MFU 730R. This is another XJ Coupe, Daimler Sovereign Coupe. This is a 4.2 with the Series 3 wheel trims on it. And BXX 835, that's a 1935 car. I think that's another 15 horsepower saloon. Very regal looking machine. There's a V8 250 alongside a Jaguar Mark 1 and a Mark 2. This was at another classic car meeting at Alton Park. Auction time, we've got a 
uh, the Daimler Series 2. I'm not sure if that's the V12 or the 4.2 straight six. Another SP250, this one on mini light type wheels. Again, at this year's Gold Cup. New JW676, another Daimler Conquest two tone car. Still got a few Daimlers to come. If you're a fan of classic Daimlers or vintage Daimlers, please let me know in the comments. Next up is HKW756, another DB18 of the early 1950s. If you're a Daimler fan, it'd be interesting to hear what you think of them in the comments, please. Now, a P registration coupe. Very nice indeed. This is a February 76 registered car with a 4.2 litre XK engine under its bonnet. Another period photo. This is a Conquest photographed back in 1969. Lost in Land Crab alongside it. Just a few damers to go now. Rear three quarter view of a black or dark blue SP250. Fantastic looking car, especially from the rear, I think. 866 TPF, that's a March 1961 3.8 Daimler Majestic. These were built from 1958 to 1962. This is a six cylinder car, the Major had the 4.5 litre V8. And the oldest car in this particular collection, this is an 1897 4 horsepower twin cylinder car. I'm guessing this is probably on the London to Brighton. PAS 305, I think that is a DB17, another Cabriolet car. Very handsome indeed, and that particular dame that rounds out this collection of photographs. I hope that was of interest. Uh, please uh, check out some of the other classic and vintage car videos now on the old Classic Car channel. More videos along very, very soon. Bye for now.